Sam from the Aragon Growth Guild. Today I'll be showing you how to do an airdrop using the Aragon app and Coinvice. So let's get into it. Start from app.aragon.org and create a DAO. Click build your DAO and then select your blockchain. I'm going to go with Polygon and then describe your DAO. So add the name, logo, description. Once you've added that, click next. Now you're going to choose token holders for who can participate in governance. And then to mint your token, just add the name of the token as well as the symbol. Now for the airdrop to work, what you're gonna to wanna to do is distribute all of the tokens to your own wallet. So I wanna have 10 tokens circulating and I'm going to distribute them to my wallet and then Decide who's eligible to create proposals. I'm gonna go with token holders with two tokens and then click next. Select your governance settings. So support threshold, I will keep that at 50%. That's just the percentage of tokens that need to vote yes in support of a proposal for the proposal to pass. Minimum participation, that's the percentage of tokens that need to participate in a proposal so they can vote yes or no. So I'll keep that at 15%. Minimum duration, I'll keep that at one day. That's just the shortest amount of time a proposal can be live for voting. And then I'll allow early execution. So that means if a proposal hits these two thresholds up here, it can be executed early. And if I have this turned on, I cannot have vote change. So that'll be turned off. Click next. Now I just need to go through and make sure all these values are correct. Okay, deploy your DAO. I'll pay a gas fee. Okay, now I can launch my DAO dashboard. Open your DAO. Okay, now my DAO is live. I can see that in the community, there's just one member with all of the tokens I minted, but now we're going to create an airdrop so that that's about to change. So start from coinvice.co and click create. You're going to choose a wallet drop to create. All right, now I'm gonna select the token that I just minted. So I need to paste in the contract address of the token. And then the way you can get that address is back on the Aragon app. You can see the wallet that I just minted the token to, and then I can head over to ERC20 transactions, find the token I just created, click on it. And then that's my contract address right there. That's my test token that I just created. Grab this address hop back over into Coinvice, paste it in. Okay, click use and see that's my test token, it just appeared. Airdrop title, okay, click next. Now I'm going to choose my airdrop recipients. So I can paste in different wallet addresses and then just assign a number of tokens to them. I can upload a CSV here, or I can head down to all these different plugins they have and grab wallet addresses from Twitter, Snapchat, Poaps, lots of different ways. Um, so I'm just gonna paste in a couple addresses up here. So I just added these two addresses and I wanna give two tokens to each of them. So I just separate that with a comma. Scroll down, you can see that I'm airdropping to two wallet addresses and that's gonna be four out of the 10 tokens will be airdropped. So now just click next. Okay, so I just have to sign two transactions to create the airdrop and then send the tokens. So first I just need to approve the test token and I'll sign a transaction to do that. Great, that transaction is signed and now I just need to send the tokens. Click send, approve that. Okay, the tokens have been sent. I can see the transaction up here, click view, and then I can see it on Polygon scan to see the two addresses that I just airdropped two tokens to each. So I can see that the airdrop was completed, that 
a total of four tokens were sent, distributed to the, these two wallets here. And now those are voting members in my DAO. So that's how you create an airdrop using the Aragon app and Coinbase.